Russia is not the largest country in the world. After this statement, many will probably say, what are you talking about? Did you study geography at school? Do I have a geographical map? Try to Google it. Russia is the largest country in the world. Everyone knows that. Nevertheless, Russia is not as big as it seems at first glance. If you look at a map that has a Mercator projection, you can see that Russia is more extensive than Africa. But this is not true. If we move the country closer to the equator, we will see that in reality the area of Russia is smaller than the area of Africa. On maps with the Mercator projection, objects located at the poles of the map are stretched to enormous sizes. But that's not all. Vast territories of Russia are practically unsuitable for human life due to the harsh climate. In large part of Russia, it's practically impossible to conduct any productive economic activity. In the far north of the country, you can find many settlements that began to disappear after they lost their funding after the collapse of the USSR. It's difficult to argue with nature. The habitat most comfortable for our species, I mean Homo sapiens, is located in more southern latitudes. I tried to calculate the territory of each country comfortable for living Homo sapiens. For this purpose I used the Maxent program, which is widely used to model the spatial distribution of living organisms using the maximum entropy method and uh, bioclimatic data biocli. In short, the program requires GPS coordinates or the location of specimens of a species of living organisms and climatic data such as temperature, humidity and uh, so on. Using this data, the Maxent provides an answer to the question of where the analyzed species of living organisms with a certain degree of probability can grow or inhabit. I did the same, only instead of the location of living organisms, I used uh, settlements with a population of more than 100 people. As a result, I got such map. There is how the world map looks in terms of climate comfort for human life. Russia as a result is not the largest country in the world. The largest nation in the world is Brazil, followed by the United States, China, Australia, and uh, Russia is in the fifth place. In Russia, the climate most comfortable for human life predominantly has only the European part of the country, and the Far East located on the Pacific coast. You can find a link to more detailed maps in the description. Nevertheless, technology is continuously evolving. Modern technologies make it possible to conduct productive economic activity in more severe climatic conditions. Homo sapiens became less dependent on the climate. The harsh environment makes you think and develop, because otherwise you cannot survive in such circumstances. If you look at Europe, the most developed countries are located in the north of the continent. But the climate is changing. Recently in Russia the climate has changed a lot. I remember from childhood severe frost in the European part of Russia, which are now practically not observed. About how the climate of Russia will change in the future, I will tell you next time. <laughs>